There's one, guys. He's running at me, so I can't tell if he's big. Oh, he's big. He is big. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Aquaholic fishing here and we are on the San Antonio River basically the lower end of the San Antonio River walk and we'll be working up towards the river walk and looking for that Guadalupe bass it's a kind of nasty little morning it's 50 degrees it got a light rain it's a beautiful day if you're a duck and there's one right there it's not great, but it's one of those days. Could be a little better, and it sure could be a lot worse. It's a beautiful shot going down towards uh, the south end of the river. All right, guys. Let's get on some fish. Let's find that Guadalupe bass that is so difficult to find. I'll see that show that he's not really that hard to find. He's elusive. But we'll get him. He's not that elusive. He's got to eat, right? He's got to eat something. Now, will he eat what we're throwing? We're about to find out. There's no guarantees. Only guarantee right now is that I'm going to get wet because it's pretty rainy out here. Good old San Antonio, Texas. Home of the Riverwalk, home of the Alamo, home of SeaWorld, home of Six Flags Fiesta Texas, home of a lot of cool stuff. San Antonio is a really good place and although much of the fishing is pressured like many will say, there's a lot of good fishing opportunities guys, as a matter of fact. There's a good fishing opportunity right there. This one feels pretty decent too. That kind of feels like a large mouth, but he might be a lot. Whatever he is, he's pretty heavy. Looks like it might be a big wasp. Believe it is. There's that elusive guy that we're looking for. Come here, sweet boy. Come here, you sweet boy. Just like that, guys. Looks like a smallmouth bass, but it's not. That's a big wad. Beautiful Guadalupe bass, guys. Look at that guy. Gorgeous. Glad he didn't break the line or get off. He wasn't hooked very good at all. And these things don't get super huge. That's a big wad. Let's get him back in the water, see if we can't get us another one. All right, buddy. We appreciate you. Have a great day, dude. And there he goes, guys. Whoa. What was that? He's chasing him, too. Boy, he got mad. They almost fought. He's still chasing him off. That is crazy. He thought he was going to scoop up one of his birds, I guess. Look at this guy. He comes now, he's mad. They're putting in work protecting the babies. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. Oh, this you crazy mother. He's running at me, so I can't tell if he's big. Oh, he's big. He is big. That's a three or a four. That's a large mouth, I think. Don't you bring me up into that branch. That's a large one. That's a big fish. For this river, baby. I can't, can't grab him any other way, but drag him up this bank, guys. I might lose him. It's a beautiful fish. In case I lose him. You can see how big he is. He's a three. I'm not crawling down in that water with him. 
is a chunky little football. Not bad. Big fish. Beautiful little guy. Oh, he's eating. Gorgeous, just a chunk. Almost a three, two thirteen. Beautiful. All right, buddy, you're going back. Here's your lucky day. Have a great one, dude. Appreciate you. Hey, what's going on, gorgeous? You got some babies with you. Look at you. Look at those little ones behind them, guys. What a sweet mama shot. That is so awesome. Little bitty ones back there trying to keep up. <laughs> That's incredible. That's some good stuff. That's a Guadalupe bass. You don't see these very often. Have a good day. Good morning, how are you? Just a little wad. About a pound, real skinny guy. Have a good day, buddy. Morning. How are you? Doing? How are you?